Dear students, in this topic, we shall study the changes or fluctuations in pressure and flow of blood during one heart beat. You know that chambers of the heart contract during each heart beat in a sequence. The rhythm of these contractions results in a sequential fluctuation of pressure and flow of blood in the circulatory system. We shall study all the contraction and relaxation events of the heart in sequence and see their effect on pressure and flow. First, we shall start from the diastole phase. During diastole, the aortic valves are closed. Ventricles and atria are in relaxed position. The pressure difference between the relaxed chambers and the systemic and pulmonary arteries is large. Yani ke jo arterial system hai usme pressure comparatively zyada hai aur chambers relaxed hai unme pressure kam hota hai is liye pressure difference zyada hota hai. During the diastole the atrioventricular walls remain open. Is liye blood from the venous system jisme ke pressure zyada hai flows directly into the ventricles via the atria by venous filling pressure. Venous filling pressure jo hai wo ventricles ki filling mein important role play karta hai. Now the next phase is the atrial contraction. When atria contract as a result pressure rises in them. As a result, the blood is ejected or flows into the ventricles. Dear students, the atrial contraction provides only 30% volume of the total ventricular output or ventricular capacity. So, this 70% jo hai, yani larger volume of the ventricles is filled by the venous filling pressure during diastole. So atrial contraction only or simply tops up nearly full ventricles. Jo 70% pehle full hai, atrial contraction ke dije mein baki ke 30% bhi fill ho jate hai. Now when ventricles are filled and atrial contraction has occurred, now ventricular contraction starts. When ventricular muscles begin to contract, pressure rises in the chambers. Ye wo vakt hai jab ab uh, atrioventricular walls close ho jate hai. Taake jab ventricles contract kare, to backflow of blood from ventricle into the atria na ho jaye. Dear students, you know ke jab ventricular contraction abhi shuru hone lagti hai to us wakt to aortic walls abhi close the. Wo abhi close hi rahenge. Ventricles is closing ki wajah se become sealed chambers. Kyunke atrioventricular walls bhi close ho gaye hain. Dousi taraf se aortic walls bhi abhi open nahi huye. Wo bhi band hain. Lehada ventricles become closed chambers. So pressure rises in them without a volume change. It means that the ventricular contraction is isometric. Now, as the pressure in ventricles exceeds that of the aorta and pulmonary arteries, the aortic valves open. 
एटिक वॉल्व की ओपनिंग की वजह से ब्लड इज इजेक्टेड इन टू द एटा एंड पलमोनरी आर्टरीज एज ए रिजल्ट ब्लड फ्लोस इन टू दिस्टेमिक एंड पलमोनरी स्ट्रक्चर सर्किट एंड वेंट्रिकुलर वॉल्यूम डिक्रीजेस देर स्टूडेंट्स आफ्टर पंपिंग द वेंट्रिकल्स begin to relax intraventricular pressure falls aortic valves close atrioventricular valves open ventricular filling starts again by venous filling pressure and the cycle is repeated